What up, Melvin7 here, and today I'm bringing you Who Performs Best, Episode 2. It's going to be Muriel versus Menes. Like in Episode 1, I've already played the game, so I'm not going to show you the record, because that could give you a hint as to who performed better. But anyhow, I've built a cheap team this time. I wanted to kind of, you know, stray away from the expensive players. I mean, if things go tits up, I can bring them off. Uh, sorry, bring them on, on the bench, off the bench, yeah, that, uh, you know what I mean. Anyway, this team, probably Bar Sandro, goes for like 5 to 10k. Can't really imagine it going for too much, but I've moved Falcao down to a cam so we get the chemistry from Uriel Jimenez. But that's not the important thing. The important thing is the highlights, which we'll go on to now. I'll be totally honest with you, I didn't really like these two as a partnership. I don't know what it was. They are great at dribbling, but they're finishing left something to be desired. Honestly, they were absolutely abominable. I don't know if that's because of the way I played in these three games, but I was on a good form in FIFA uh, during the day. I'd won a lot of games with other teams, but um, yeah, overall, I mean, th this team was solid in defence, but it didn't create too much going forward. And as I say, the finishing of Muriel Jimenez, I'm showing you clips uh, not just the goals, some of the misses that you will see from both Menes and Muriel. I think this is the first goal, actually, and it was Muriel who did take it. That was, uh, well, that was certainly his best finish of the entire three games. But uh, the next player we come up against has a very solid team. It's a really good hybrid. Three league, he's got Robin, he's got Sanchez, he's got Muller, he's got Bonucci and... Um, Barzagli in defence, but yeah, nice interchange here from Muriel and Menez. Menez bursting through, and that's got to take the bait for the worst finish of the episode. Like that finesse had no chance of going in; it just was curling away. And my opponent, this was a really frustrating game. I felt like I was creating a lot of chances, but I just kept screwing up my chances. And he scored from a corner, but straight after that, Muriel dribbles through. And calmly blasts it over the bar. So, uh, yeah, that was a bit disappointing. But I needed some firepower. I brought on Skulls. I brought on uh, Rykard. I brought on Pogba. And um, eventually, this highlight, we didn't actually break through. But eventually, we do. We get a little bit of luck. It comes out to Menez. And uh, he finishes that to make it 1-1. Then, later on in the game, Skulls. Lovely ball through to Muriel. He was bringing his keeper out a hell of a lot. So, I thought I'd chip... But his goalkeeper, Handanovic, is pretty overpowered and he caught that one. And yet again, brought him out again. Couldn't find the chip though because Handanovic made another great save. So we did end up drawing that 1-1. Of course, I'll show you the ratings at the end of the video, of course, with these players. But yeah, uh, moving on to the next team. He's got a very solid team there, to be fair. Remy, Lacazette up front with Kabai as a cam. It's a, it's a decent team, to be fair. Fairly similar to the Lacazette squad builder I've got on my channel. But anyway, Menes to Falcao there making it 1-0 nine minutes in but um straight after that i think it's uh muriel this time who finds falco and uh, falco's a cam actually worked i was quite surprised but my opponent does get a late constellation goal with luis suarez but uh, i did win 2-1 so uh moving on to the ratings in game one, Muriel got an 8.6 and Menez a 7.2. That was definitely Muriel's most deficit, I suppose. Uh, game two, we had Muriel 8.2, Menez 8.4. Game three, Muriel 9.3 and uh, Menez 9.0. I don't know how the ratings were so high. I didn't really think they were that clinical. But going off those ratings, it's very obvious who has won. And it's Muriel by 0.5. So maybe I was a little harsh to Muriel. But I, I don't know, I just didn't enjoy it. Like, there wasn't a game where we scored more than two goals. We created so many chances, but so many were wayward. So, um, you know, let me know what you think of these two players. Obviously, Muriel now progresses to the quarterfinal. Menez is out. But let me know what you think of these players. Do you think their finishing's good? Is it just me? I don't know. But anyway, hopefully you have enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already. Like the video. And yeah, peace.